somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. back. That's the answer. This is the Appleton Oak. I'm Mason Quinn. Guys, tonight we are starting a whole new franchise, one that all of you out there have been anxiously awaiting. Ooh. We're starting off with 2010's How to Train Your Dragon. Now, this is going to be a first time watch for me. I have not seen it. Uh, this seemed to fall in a time where it seemed like a bunch of these movies were just coming out one after another, mm. and I could hardly keep up, but uh, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I actually saw the first one of the trilogy. I have not seen the next two, so I'm definitely ready willing and able to see if you guys like the first one because i'm also excited then to continue the adventure yeah you know this this time 2010 you know i mm -hmm. like 31 or whatever you know nieces and nephews aren't of age to be watching these kind of movies i've never seen this movie and to be honest other than something with training your dragon i i know nothing about this movie whatsoever he's, uh, he's expecting rocky montages also uh that it came very very highly recommended and its score on rotten tomatoes <laughs> is 99 percent. yeah that's uh, just a measly 99 it's usually a pretty fair indication that we're in for something good mm -hmm. all right so without further ado let's go this is Perk. It's 12 days north of Hopeless and a few degrees <laughs> south of freezing to death. My village. In a word, sturdy. We have fishing, hunting, and a charming view of the sunsets. The only problems are the pests. Oh. You see, most places have mice or mosquitoes. We have... Look at the dragon. Dragons. Teeth. <laughs> That's Stoic the Vast. Chief of the tribe. Any night furies? None so far. Good. I thought you'd been carried off. What, who, me? No, nah, come on. They wouldn't know what to do with all this. <laughs> <laughs> I've been his apprentice ever since I was little. See? Old village, lots and lots of new houses. Oh. <laughs> he gets the walk away explosion <laughs> scene. <laughs> I need to make my mark. Oh, you've made plenty of marks. All in their own places. Please, two minutes. I'll kill a dragon. One day I'll get out there. A natterhead is sure to get me at least noticed. A simple back. Oh. <laughs> Only the best Vikings go after those. Oh. We call it the... Knife Fury! Get down! No one has ever killed a Knife Fury. Stay. Put. <laughs> I didn't see Adam's leg. Mind leg. Uh. <laughs> yourself. Oh, that is pretty badass. Oh, I hit it. Oh, he's bare hand in that sucker. Oh, and there's one more thing you need to know. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. Mm. Ah, okay. Oh, it's his dad. Yep. Okay, but I hit a night fury. Oh, uh, it's not like the last few times, Dad. You guys were busy, and I had a very clear shot. It went down. Every time you step outside, disaster falls. Winter is almost here, and I have an entire village to feed. I see a dragon, and I have to just kill it, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Get is back this to Gerard the Butler? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Make not sure he Gerald. gets there. Oh. <laughs> oh, I thought it was just sounded like Gerard Butler. I really did hit one. Sure. He never listens. Well, it runs the and, and when he does, disappointed scowl like someone skimped on the meat in his sandwich. I'm afraid you brought me the wrong offspring. This is a talking <laughs> fish <bowl. laughs> It's not so much what you look like, it's what's inside that he can't stand. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just go like that. Like that's a moment. <laughs> Oh, uh, wow, that was bad. Uh, it's not the way you look. It's what's on the, the inside. inside. <laughs> oh, my That's God. That's what he dislikes. 
Either we finish them or they'll finish us. If we find the nest and destroy it, the dragons will leave. We're Vikings. It's an occupational hazard. Now, who's with me? Sounds like 300 with an accent. Yeah. <laughs> this is Sparta. Those who stay will look after Hiccup. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, kid can't catch a break. And while I'm busy, Hiccup can cover the stall. Oh, what am I going to do with him, Gobber? Put him in training with the others. No, I'm serious. So am I. You know what he's like. From the time he could crawl, he's been different. I take him fishing and he goes hunting for... Trolls exist. They steal your socks. But only the left ones. What's with that? <laughs> His tooth fell out. <laughs> Even as a boy, I knew what I was, what I had to become. You can't stop him, Stoic. You can only prepare him. He's going to get out there again. He's probably out there now. I managed to lose an entire dragon. Ow! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> I have brought down this mighty beast. No. I'm going to cut out your heart and take it to my father. Eyes. Yeah, just the detail in the eye, like how long that probably took. Yeah. Uh, I have to talk to you, Dad. I need to speak with you too, son. I, I think it's time you learn to fight, fight dragons. dragons. What? Dragon training. You start in the morning. Oh man, I should have gone first. Do we have enough bread making Vikings or small home repair? <laughs> small <laughs> home repair. Small <laughs> home repair. <laughs> I can't kill dragons. But you will kill dragons. It's serious, son. When you carry this axe, you carry all of us with you. You talk like us. You think like us. This conversation is feeling very one-sided. Deal. Deal. Good. Welcome to Dragon Training. No turning back. That's an interesting arena. Would they bring in Michael Bay just for that shot? Yeah, just yeah. for that one. <laughs> I'm hoping for some mauling, like on my shoulder, lower back. Pain. Love it. <laughs> oh, great. Who let him in? The recruit who does best will win the honor of killing his first dragon. Hiccup already killed a Night Fury, so can I transfer <laughs> to the class with the cool Vikings? Don't worry. You're small and you're weak. They'll see you as sick or insane and... Jesus. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> I believe in landing on the job. Today is about survival. If you get blasted, you're dead. Your most important piece of equipment is your shield. Tough nut, rough nut, get out. All dragons have a limited number of... Oh, that's cool. They showed the dragon vision there. Get in there! Oh, I guess it's just you and me, huh? Nope, just you. Pick up! <laughs> Give the old fish hook. You'll get another chance, don't you worry? A dragon will always go for the kill. Ah, uh, except, uh, except it didn't. Not always. Yeah. Well, this was stupid. <laughs> Something's wrong. Hey, with it. must be hurt. Why don't you just fly away? Ah, its tail mm. thrown off its balance. 
<laughs> I mistimed my somersault dive. It was sloppy. It threw off my reverse tumble. Everything we know about every dragon we know of. So I guess we'll share? Reddit. <laughs> dragon classifications. Thunder drum. This reclusive dragon inhabits sea caves and dark tide pools. When startled, the thunder drum produces a concussive sound that can kill a man. <laughs> oh, <they> can. <laughs> Extremely dangerous. Kill on sight. <laughs> Night Fury. The unholy offspring of lightning and death itself. Your only chance. Hide and pray does not find you. I can almost smell them. They're close. I mean... This animation's pretty, pretty good. Yeah, I mean, for 2010, it's pretty impressive. Seems like we always say that for this year. Yeah. yeah. Forget Ooh. there was still pretty good technology. Whoa, focus, Hancock. Not us, but quicker and light on the feet. Your job is to be quicker and lighter. Oh, whoa. Hmm. oh can throw him? Look for its blind spot. Every dragon has one. Find it. It's just like oh pitch black. <laughs> but I can do one. Is that what it is? You stand right in front yeah, of him. Yeah, he stands right in front of him. Yeah. How would one sneak up on a night fury? No one's ever met one and lived to tell the tale. Watch out, babe. I'll take care of this. <laughs> <laughs> totally misses. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Just, Just put so their food on his face. <laughs> is this some kind of a joke to you? Our parents' war is about to become ours. Figure out which side you're on. <laughs> it's like a cat up there with them <laughs> eyes kind of looking mm -hmm. at him. <laughs> Kick it. <laughs> Splash. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> Switchblade teeth. I don't have any more. Oh, oh, it's oh. Yeah. Uh, it's sharing with him. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, the details they do in here. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, uh, a little sushi. Just <laughs> <laughs> trying to smile. <laughs> you know how many dogs and cats would love to be able to do with that? What mm -hmm. Toothless just did. <laughs> Hanging over the tree like a bat. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Does it want him to dance? Kind of. <laughs> oh. oh. Trust, trust isn't all there. 
Isn't it weird to think that your hand was inside a dragon? I'll chop up the legs of every dragon I fight with my face. If it can't fly, it can't get away. A downed dragon uh, is a dead dragon. Yeah. Tomorrow we get to the big boys. Who will win the honor of killing him? Tattoo? It's not a tattoo. It's a birthmark. Okay, I've been stuck with you. Oh, he's gonna make him something here. I hope you're hungry. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. Work fast. Okay. <laughs> 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 works. Oh, just gotta find a way to get that thing to stay out. Now, a wet dragon head can't light its fire. One head breathes gas, the other head lights it. Your job is to know which is which. Prefers ambush attack, crushing its victims. Will you please stop that? Ah! Hey, it's us, idiots. Ah! Ah! Wait. Whoa. Looks like something Tim Burton would design. Fish lines! <laughs> no, hang up! Yeah. Now, Dad, don't you make me tell you again! Yes, that's right. Now think about what you've done. Oh, the eel. <laughs> 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 hey. <laughs> he made a oh, saddle. That's saddle. what that was. Yeah, and then he can control the uh, <laughs> the flap back there. Oh, that's what he's picking up on. <laughs> They're all like, "What is this guy got going on?" <laughs> You guys go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. Yeah, they like back the scratches, scratches behind the ears. Oh. No, that's exactly what they do. Yeah. <laughs> 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 a little scratch. Hey, it's... Razor <laughs> <laughs> pointer. Meet the terrible terror. Yeah, it's like the size of me. My... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm very much hurt. I'm very much sure. Uh oh. <laughs> Look at the whole, bu the whole got, bucket. It's got them all rigged up here. Oh, look at that. Oh, he's bringing them into town. Okay. <laughs> he's always looking for something <laughs> going in the garbage. Yep. Are you in there? <laughs> it's like wide open. I normally don't care what people do, but you're acting weird. <laughs> oh, these guys look like they took a beating. Yeah, I trust you found the nest at least. Not even close. Congratulations, Stoic! Everyone is so relieved. We can barely walk through the village without being swarmed by his new van. <laughs> Position three, zone four. All right, let's go, Tony. Let's go, Tony. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna skim the water. 
Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Almost there. Oh. Just pull up, 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 uh, no thanks. I'm good. Oh, I'm gonna hang out. <laughs> like a little chihuahua or something. <laughs> there you go. Everything we know about you guys is wrong. Dad, you're back. I, uh, <laughs> uh, Gobber's not here. Never mind these notes. Well, I came looking for you. Y you did? Just how long did you think you could hide it from me? Nothing happens on this island without me hearing about it. About that dragon. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> 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 Uh, uh, upset? Uh, uh, what? Just wait till you spill a nadder's guts for the first time. What the yeah. feeling? Oh, <laughs> you really had me going there, son. Odin, it was rough. I almost gave up on you. We finally have something to talk about. Well, about that. I, uh, I, I brought you something. Thanks. Ah, uh, your mother would have wanted you to have it. Keeps her, keeps her close, you know. Oh, I should really get to bed. Yes. Oh. Stay out of my way. It's not trying to fight him. It's just looking for hiccup. <laughs> His um, leg is up. His leg is up. <laughs> not so fast. Uh, I, I'm kind of late for a while. Late. Okay, quiet down. The elder has decided. You get to kill the dragon! Yeah. We're leaving. Let's pack up. Oh, oh. What the? Uh, 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 I want to know what's going on. No one just gets as good as you do. I, I've been making outfits. <gasps> get down! Oh. oh, she's gonna, the dragon's gonna think he's hitting her. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> She's a friend. Astrid? Toothless. Toothless? Astrid. Da da da, we're dead. Oh, ah! oh great Odin's ghost! Oh, great Odin's ghost! ghost. <laughs> great Odin's ghost! Ah! <laughs> Get me down from here! You have to give me a chance to explain. <laughs> Nothing to be afraid of. He's not usually like this. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing barrel rolls. And now the spinning. Thank you for nothing, you useless reptile. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Just get me off of this thing. Oh, now he's getting a nice camera. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> the music right away. The saxophone. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's, come on. Worse just the Northern be, Lights. Why that not? Just, that would just be amazing. <laughs> Talk about a wingman. Go ahead and figure oh, it, oh. Figuratively and literally <laughs> speaking. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, let's be careful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh, oh. All right, I admit it. It's amazing. He's amazing. Hiccup, your final exam is tomorrow. Kill the dragon. Oh, don't remind me. Toothless, what's happening? Is he 
hearing something. Oh, we have many dragons. Oh, wow. What's going on? I don't know. It looks like they're hauling in their kill. What does that make us? Oh, they're going to the nest. Well, this is interesting. Okay, we're going on a vertical climb. It's got to be the nest, right? It has to be. Yep. But my dad wouldn't give to find this. Why are they just dropping them down there, though? Oh. oh. We gotta get out of here. Now. Whoa. That's the one they must have to keep happy. Mm. They're the workers, and that's their queen. Let's find your dad. No, no, not yet. They'll kill Toothless. No. Hiccup, we just discovered the dragon's nest. To protect your pet dragon? Are you serious? Yes. Integrity. And again, they could take out his entire family. So yeah, there's that. But, but there's no way they could take out that huge no, dragon. No. That's for kidnapping me. <laughs> That's for everything else. <laughs> All right. All right. Fair trade. Yeah. Are you, what are you looking at? <laughs> <laughs> Show my face in public again. If someone had told me that Come in on, a man. few short weeks, Hiccup would go from, well, being, uh, the Hiccup oh to placing goodness. first in dragon training, no one's more surprised or more proud than I am. Oh, this is going to be a big letdown, Pops. Today, he becomes one of us. Be careful with that dragon. It's not the dragon I'm worried about. If something goes wrong. Just make sure they don't find Toothless. I will. It's time, Hiccup. Knock him dead. I don't know if he knows how to deal with this guy. Go on, Hiccup. Give it to him. What is he doing? I'm not one of them. Stop the fight. No. I need you all to see this. They're not what we think they are. I said stop the fight. He's moving. <laughs> nice. Night Fury. Right, shoot, let's go. Get out of here. Oh, uh, you knew they were going to do this to us. Put it with the others. We had a deal. I know we did, but that, that was before I you'd be mad at me. But please, just don't hurt Toothless. That's what you're worried about? They've killed hundreds of us. And we've killed thousands of them. If they don't bring enough food back, they'll be eaten themselves. So you've been to the nest. Did I say nest? How did you find that? Toothless did. Only a dragon can find the island. Dad, no, please, it's not what you think. You don't know what you're up against. I promise you, you can't win this one. Would you please just listen to me? Oh. You're not my son. <sighs> yeah, that's gonna do anything. You know, the dragons have been doing them a favor by feeding mm -hmm. that huge thing. I mean... Uh, well, of course they don't know. Yeah, they don't know how massive the thing is. <sighs> Lead 
us home. Devil. It's a mess. <laughs> You've lost everything. Your father, your tribe, your best friend. Thank you for summing that up. Why couldn't I have killed that dragon when I found him in the woods? Why didn't you? I don't know. I was a coward. I was weak. 300 years, and I'm the first Viking who wouldn't kill a dragon. First to ride one, though. I wouldn't kill him because he looked as frightened as I was. I bet he's really frightened now. What are you going to do about it? Uh, probably something stupid. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sound your positions. Stay within your shot. If you're planning on getting eaten, I'd definitely go with the Gronkle. You're crazy. I like that. <laughs> so, what is the plan? <laughs> That's not really <laughs> encouraging. Oh, <laughs> it's hanging there. That's not very encouraging. Stay low. <laughs> Oh, yeah. yeah, no. Oh, oh, saw a little something. <gasps> and they know it. I feel like it's going to be like, like crickets. They just look up and there's thousands of them. <laughs> this, guy. <laughs> this guy with his... <laughs> Going to hell. Uh -uh. I believe that's an, an underbite, didn't it, Oak? It's okay. Under jet, under bite. <laughs> 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 it ends today. <laughs> oh, that's a lot. <laughs> They're all just flying out. Yeah. That's interesting. I didn't go after a single person. They all just mm -hmm. flew out. A lot of them are flying out. We've done it! Uh -oh. Form your ranks. Hold together. Oh boy. That is a problem. That is what uh, Hiccup was talking about. Catch a pulse! <laughs> it's like throwing softballs at it. Get to the ships! No! 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 Oh, uh, sh what ships? Uh, there you go, your ships. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I was a fool. I could buy them a few minutes if I give that thing someone to hunt. Then I can double that time. <laughs> He's never seen him ride, ride a dragon before. Moai's large nostrils relies on hearing and smell. Make some noise, keep it confused. Rough, tough, find out if it has a shot. Right, we got it covered. Yeah! Right out, right up, Rendell. <laughs> <laughs> um, this thing doesn't have a blind spot. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, it's working. I can't miss. Oh, 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 oh. he's jamming oh, his man. eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Pops is going down to do it. Look at that, ripping it right apart. You got it, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. For, for everything. You don't have to go up there. We're Vikings. I'm proud to call you my son. Yeah, 
always at work. <laughs> 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 oh, oh no, no, it's create a vacuum. No. Oh. <laughs> See, oh. They, they, that thing's... they don't know much about night. Well, no. as you saw in the beginning, he had the blue flames. Oh, yeah. Holy so you know that. Shit. Oh, oh, and now he's flying. Oh, 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 look at that thing. Can't fly like that. No. Oh, got him. Oh, get him high enough to, yeah, to slip out falls. his wings. Watch out! Oh, right in the Remember oh, all the right oh, Remember. Yep. yep. The gas. Uh oh. Yep. Hit the brakes and oh. fly right by. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> oh, no. 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 Oh. Hey, cop. I did this. Have him under That's what I'm thinking. Maybe he, he have him protected him through the flames. Maybe. Does he have him under his wing? Hiccup! He's alive! You brought him back alive! That's how you do a movie. Thank you for saving my son. Most of them. Oh. That's just like when Toothless needed help. I'm dead. <laughs> no, but you gave it your best shot. Turns out all we needed was a little more. This. Ah, <laughs> nice. That's for scaring me. Was it always going to be this way? This. <laughs> uh, could get used to it. <laughs> oh, look at that. The food that grows here is tough and tasteless. The people that grow here are even more so. Tough and tasteless. The only upsides are the pets. We have dragons. Oh, what a winner! What a winner. First off, thank you. That was so much fun. That was How to Train Your Dragon, and I think all of us thoroughly enjoyed it. They did such an amazing job with setting up the story, and it's, it is it is a similar story of a young son seeking his father's approval. Uh, he doesn't quite fit in with the way everything is done, and this was just great. He discovers the the night fury dragon toothless and they did such an amazing job with with tooth, toothless in giving him the traits of a cat a dog even a bat there for a yep. little bit and anybody Wait, who's had down. yeah and anybody who's <laughs> had pets like saw their their pets in what toothless was doing and i think that that was absolutely done on purpose so that you as the viewer kind of make almost a subconscious connection between your pets and toothless because man at the end there i was i was honestly a little bit worried i didn't know which way they were gonna go with it but uh the music in this was awesome as well i mean the um, early on in the movie they really hit the score with just a, a ton of great music that was really fitting and it was it was just a fantastic movie with just an awesome storyline you know trying to get acceptance and the way things are being done aren't always the right way i mean here it turns out that the only reason this village wasn't wiped out mm -hmm. is because the dragons have been coming taking their cows and sheep and feeding this huge monster to keep it at bay you know so without them even knowing uh without the vikings even knowing the dragons have been keeping them safe this whole time and to me that was that was just awesome and again i cannot stress enough 
the amazing job that the the animators and and the crew the the digital arts people that they did with toothless i mean everything from his eyes the mannerisms oh, the were, detail like yeah the detail it was just incredible i could have sat and just watched <laughs> toothless just do stuff for for hours just all the little quirks and the movements and the little gestures it was so well done and so tied into like i mean anybody who's had a dog who's gotten it all revved up and see the way they the run zoomies. around the house some <laughs> that's that's exactly what they do it was just it was so great the way they did that and i i can't put this put this movie over enough um i'll let you guys kind of hit on a few things here i'm gonna get my score out and if uh if anything pops up we'll certainly get to it but for me it's not even a, <laughs> it's not even a question guys everybody out there is right you guys were all right rotten tomatoes was right five <laughs> out of five answers for me on how to train your dragon i can't imagine how they get better than this but i'm sure they I'm, will because there's two more to go i don't know i'm looking forward to this but yes the whole the whole play with a person and their pet that's what they strive for this and you know it even it was kind of like you know a, like a an abandoned pet where like he had to get it to learn to trust him mm -hmm. and to believe in him and so he, he had to do the small things, give it a little food, to it. all this other stuff. He figured out, okay, I can touch him now. I can do this. And so through that, then he learned about all the other dragons. So it was, so he found that that spot. Yeah. <laughs> you know, every cat and every dog that you have, they just love that one spot right here. You know, that gets their leg just a going, or in <laughs> or in Toothless's case, just falls <laughs> falls over. He's asleep. Ground. Like you saw him rolling around in grass. Who hasn't had a dog or a cat just go outside and just ah. Oh, Oh, this is amazing yeah. you get their stink all over there you know because <laughs> that's what they love to do but the animation was top notch the voice acting was awesome they like i honestly the with how they had hiccup with um uh jay baruto mm -hmm. if that's how you say his name it was perfect i thought he was perfect for this role he because was. he the his delivery and how he was and like and like you can kind of think as if this was live action he would be perfect for because he'd be doing the same he'd mannerisms the, same, guy, the yeah. same like oh boy and then he's like and now you're spinning <laughs> thanks you useless reptile <laughs> i loved what he said that what he's it's like hey we're trying to win her over to <laughs> what are you doing <laughs> but just everything and even gerald butler just being that that tough dad that mm -hmm. you know comes through in the end because you know toothless is there for everyone so of course you know my answer is gonna be five <laughs> answers because yes i've seen this one and like i i'm i'm now gonna probably end up kicking myself for not seeing the second or third oh, I'm but you did. thanks to you guys i'm gonna be ready willing and able right. to see the next two and there was a lot of references in pitch black in here i thought maybe i'm wrong uh, maybe i'm well, right just the you one guys drop just in the, the comments for sure let me know Whose dragon is this? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, wow. This movie was this movie was unbelievable. I mean, really uh, <laughs> like 99% on Rotten Tomatoes. Who's who's the one yeah. who's the who's the one percent? Who's the I, dick? I, who's the one who's the one percent that, uh, that that like that's like your review is cool. Your review is cool. I, I really <laughs> want to talk to the one percent of people, and and, and 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 honestly, just like what 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 didn't you like about this movie? Yeah. You know, I don't know if it was, um, you know, just some people who are just jagged about life or, <laughs> or, or don't like animation or 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 whatever. They don't but like pets. This was one of the most perfect movies I think I've ever seen. I mean, you know, we and we've watched some really good animated movies i loved up i loved tangled but this one was like this was right up there if not you know on, on a maybe even a little bit higher level than those i mean the animation it was was so it was so much fun i mean we'll start with that it was just a really fun movie um the toothless the way they did the animation yeah, he's kind of a dragon of kind of a salamander kind of a dog you know kind of a cat yeah. you know i mean a little i mean a little bit of everything and i think i think that's what they did is they took they took like all the like a lot a lot of the fun like characteristics that we see in in pets that make them so lovable and they worked them into the dragon personalities which just emphasized 
Yeah, like the fucking, pictures that we're looking the, the at. The right pictures now. we're looking at. I mean, it just really emphasized uh, the the fact that you can be so wrong about something and just have just drastically incorrect misconceptions. Um, the, the the from start to finish, this movie, you know, it it sucked you in with you know with some drama and some conflict, uh, comedy from start to finish. Uh, this is a movie that. Um, it, this is a movie that I, I'm imagining like kids love this movie because of all the animation and how fun it is. Watching it as adults was an incredible experience. And I think that's the challenge when you do um, animated movies like this is to make it fun for everybody. And I think, look, since, I don't know, Shrek, it seems like they've been doing a really, really good job. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, I remember... You know, when I was a little bit younger, some of the older Disney movies, and maybe if I went back and watched them now, I'd have a little bit different viewpoint. Oh, Robin Hood's you know, my favorite. You remember some of the older movies where it's like they seemed more geared towards children. And in, in some of these, it's like they, they really just nailed making these movies for everyone. Mm -hmm. And I think I, I don't think, I know, you know, one of the things I discussed when we talked about the never ending story was having these movies be lessons uh on a twofold basis one to teach the children certain lessons but also to guide parents on how to raise your children and the right lessons to instill in your children and this felt like that as well um aside from the laughs and the fun animation and everything else uh anybody who's watched this channel knows that i'm gonna pull some things um i pulled I'm going to focus on three big things that I think this movie really hit. Um, first and foremost is don't judge other people or other creatures for things that you don't understand. And I think, I don't think, I know that we live in a world where it's so easy to point fingers and to judge other people and, you know, make assumptions about their lives, you know, and we have no idea what they're going through whatsoever. And here you have uh, these Vikings that are that are you know you know just labeling these dragons as these vicious creatures, and all they're doing is they're going out and just grabbing whatever animals they can to keep themselves alive. Because if they're not doing that, then they're losing some of their own. I mean, we watched that thing just came up and. You know, didn't get enough food. Yeah, yep, didn't so. didn't have enough. Yeah, that they, one didn't give them enough. They didn't yeah. drop enough in there, so it came up and and took out ones of their own. And I think that's you know, a, a big lesson is that you know we're we're so quick to judge other people. And there's you know a, a, you know a, a million different you know cliche sayings. You know you know walk a mile in somebody else's shoes before you judge and, and things like that. But I think this really hammers home that lesson. Like, don't be so quick to judge um and there's look, there's a dozen a million different things we can apply that to in today's day and age um with certain people and things that people are going through or have been through and i, I think that's a really important lesson um the second lesson that we see a, a lot is just the the lesson of you know doing the right thing in the face of adversity or doing the right thing when it's not the popular thing to do and just going with your heart um everybody on his island everybody from the kids to the adults was you know rah rah hunt dragons um and he didn't really want to do that from the beginning he thought you know what i'll give it a try try to make my dad proud and when it came down to it he couldn't do it and that was just who he was and he went with his gut and and, and look what came of it so um trusting your instinct um you know going with your gut i think that's a big lesson here and probably the, I think the biggest lesson that, that I take away from this movie is the power of one person to make a huge, huge change. And I think sometimes we, we forget about that. And especially somebody in Hiccup's situation. I mean, you know, look at him. He, he just thought he was nobody, really. Just, you know, the most insignificant kid on the whole island. And he ended up being, you know, the, the rock star. <laughs> that they needed and i think sometimes people forget that like they they you know they don't um you know they don't believe in themselves i was at um i was at you know the arnold classic i you know I, i've spoken of that a couple of weeks ago 
We did a seminar with a guy who achieved the Lifetime Achievement Award, a guy named Flex Wheeler, who anybody, you know, in bodybuilding, you know who he is, if, if not. And he's, he's, he's a very transparent individual. You know, I know sometimes we get labeled as meatheads and stuff, but Flex is, he's an emotional individual. He's very transparent. And one of the things that he talked about is be very careful how you speak about yourself and be very careful about the thoughts that you have in your own head about yourself and and be kind to yourself and i and i think how that ties into this is like if you don't believe in yourself and you don't have positive thoughts about yourself and speak positively about yourself and work on loving yourself then you're not going to believe that you can make a change and, and and have an impact and i think that's a huge lesson in this movie is that one person can make a huge difference and look you don't have to you don't have to slay the big dragon right to make a difference all you got to do is make a difference in in your life you make a difference in one other person's life and that can snowball to levels that you never even imagined so those those are my lessons um don't judge other people's situations um do the right thing even if it's not the popular thing and never forget that one person can make a massive difference this movie um was absolutely incredible for as much as i loved up for as much as i loved tangled i, I gotta say like you know does our scale go higher than five oh, <laughs> i boy. mean we, you know we we tap out at five yeah. um it's so funny when we started oak had the hardest time giving anything a five he was yep. like guys guys that's, that's reserved for like shock 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 and, and that's and it and, and it's, yes. the more we've watched you know we guys come, guys well, guys no, and i and it can, okay, it can go so higher i will hold yeah. I will hold to that. I will yep. hold that my fives, and we've watched a lot of good movies that mm -hmm. people have been like, these are the top movies. But some of these animated movies, the the way they're able to tell these stories, and I'll look, I'll stick to that. You have, so when I give away these fives, it's not because, not oh, really Oak's really. just starting to hand out fives. I think I've given hey, fives didn't give it to, to- Didn't uh, give a five to Twilight, yeah, so. Yeah, I know. I think I've given five to, you know, maybe one or two of the Potter movies. Everything, everywhere, all at yeah. once. I think up. We'll tangle, watch a clip. Uh, yeah, tangle, never ending up. story. Oh. I mean, I mean, I, I honestly, in, in two years of doing this, yeah, you know, I don't think I could. I, I think with my hands and my toes, I could count the number of times I've done. Done fives. I've done fives, and it just it feels like more lately because you guys have been, you know, oh, you know asking, rock stars. You guys have been asking for these animated movies, and look, I don't think all of them are fives. But man, these some of these are. You know, some of these are are, are are just as good as you can get. Like, yeah. you know, Mason Quinn always says, what would you change? How would you improve upon it? And I, I can't improve can't, upon yeah. it. And I don't I don't even know, like, when the last time I said, like, I really wish, I don't know, what what did I go five times two for one of the for one of the <laughs> Five movies. squared or yeah, something like that. For something, something like that. But Maybe uh, five with the dragon's breath. On yeah, it. yeah there we go. Oomph. Something like that. Yeah. But this movie... 4.9, uh, okay. No. <laughs> it was really close. No, <laughs> you got, oh, this was, course. It, and, and now, like, I, I don't know, uh, I don't know whether to be, like, super excited about the next two mm. because there's there's so much pressure. Mm. And, I mean, look at, the, look at this cask. Jay Perugel is <laughs> Hiccup, which I didn't even know. Like, I'm like, God, I know that voice. voice I know yeah. that voice. Yep. And now it's him. Gerard Butler, America Ferrer, Kristen Wiig, TJ Miller, who, who doesn't love TJ Miller, Craig Ferguson, one of the greatest late night hosts I think ever. I can't believe I didn't know <laughs> Fish Legs Fish was, was McLovin. Yep. We got John Snow here, Kit Harrington. Um, now, was, now, was Kit in this one, or is he maybe in I don't the know if maybe this could be in the future ones. Oh, sometimes, okay. This might be the, I was going to say, yeah, like, they, I didn't recognize that before to us through the I didn't even recognize shot. his voice in this. I don't know. Maybe I know there was TJ Miller. I know yeah, there was Craig that top, Ferguson. That top list for I know sure. there was Gerard Butler. Um, so, yeah, like, yeah, like, Kit is in the second one, as we see here. Wait, uh, is. Digimon, is he, he was in this one, was he? Nope, nope, no. nope, nope. This oh, is two, two okay, that we're okay. looking at. So we're, yeah. we're seeing a nice cast coming up. Okay, so in any regard, yeah, it's, we're, so we're looking on IMDb. It's given us some of the cast from the upcoming movies, which a little bit of spoiler, but, you know. Um, we still lot, don't know what they're doing. And a lot of pressure, yeah. I mean, I, I guess I don't have any clue. I didn't know what this movie was, was about, excuse me, and I certainly don't know what the next two are about, but I am really... You know, I'm really excited about this. Just you know, some of the movies where we've done multiple movies, you know, Potter, 
everybody knows who watched Potters. If you didn't, if you, if you haven't watched our Potter reactions, just relax on me for the first two movies. I didn't pop off right Three. away for the first two. No, I think the third one. I third started. is when he I might have started have started like Azkaban. Around. I was Azkaban. like, all right, now we're getting well, that. Before it had your boy Big Rob, so no, then you no, started no, just Hunger crazy. Games, no, granted that. <laughs> Same like, boys. boys. <laughs> Hunger Games, completely different genre, but the yeah. first one I was like a, a little conflicted about, ended up loving it. So some of the series that we've done, um, you know, I, I wasn't like super excited right out the gate. I did, you know, the Planet of the Apes was pretty good, but this one was like first one. I'm like, oh god, I love it. So now I'm nervous. Like, are the other ones gonna live up to it? Don't but drop the ball. Everybody was like, you gotta watch all of them. So I'm guessing the other ones uh, are, 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 are right up there. Uh, I don't know how you get any better than this, but even if they're even close to it, I will be very happy, and I am super excited. To watch the sit in there one. flipping through the channels and happen to fall upon this and i watch it like almost every time it was on because it was on the movie channels so for appleton oak mason quinn hopefully we can help him train him to have a better intro next time <laughs> and i'm of course the answer it was great i know it was it was as always we trained you well good night pals